So how do we talk to God? Simple. Through prayer, reading, and studying his word. You can't wait to get a spot. You must go after it. Follow the Apostle Paul's example. By running hard for the finish line. Giving it all you got. Stay alert and stay on top. Read Philippians 3.14. I press towards the mark of the prize. Of the high calling of God in Christ Jesus. The last thing we have to get over is ignorance. Ignorance can be fixed. See, many of us undervalue the power of knowledge. God told us in Hosea 4, 6, My people are destroyed for the lack of knowledge because thou hast rejected knowledge. I guess this new age technology just make people so lazy. Just a click away or so they think. Everything is so rushed. People just don't take time to read or do research. But the cure to, the cure to get wisdom is to get knowledge. Wisdom is far more than money. She exceeds the glamour of wealth. Wisdom gives life, long life. Get a hold of wisdom and you'll be blessed. Now, with all that being said, I was really talking about myself. And I have some really important things to talk to y'all about tonight. May I ask you a question, Pastor? Speak, brother. Are you William Bradley? Yes, I am. Then you are under arrest for a 1993 hit and run, stealing, and the list goes on. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you can say will be used against you in the court of law. You have a right to an attorney. If you cannot afford one, one will be given to you free of charge. Do you understand these terms as I've given them to you? What's going on? You can't just barge in here like this. Yes, I can, Pastor. Church, I can't explain. I will explain. Oh, save it, Pastor. I've been on you for months, okay? And I got the pictures to prove it. You disappointed your church, your family, and your wife. It's not what you think. What are you doing? Why are you taking him? Ma'am, did you not hear what I just said? I heard you, but this is the church. You can't come up in here like this. Ma'am, you might want to back up before you oh, next. Oh, oh, Lord Jesus. Listen, just wait a minute. Let's all calm down. There's got to be an explanation. I mean, Pastor Bradley's an honorable man. Let's wait and see what happens. I mean, let's give him the benefit of the doubt. He deserves that much. Let's give him a chance. Look, we have rights, okay? That's right. We all deserve to know what happened. Now, what did he...